All right, I'm Caitlin Gross here with Jeremy Hines, and we are at the Brownstown Speedway, and he is the current points holder, correct? Yes, it is, correct, yes. And can you tell us a little bit about that? I mean, how long did it take you to achieve the very top? Well, the points start at the first race of the year. The track determines when they're going to start points, and um, I was lucky enough to win the first night of points, and uh, and we've kept, we're seven or eight into it now, so, and I've ran good enough to keep, to hold the point lead. We've got a uh, 60 point lead over Steve Barnett so so uh, hoping to keep it keep it up there tonight. Well we hope you do too. Can you tell us a little bit about your car? I mean the description on it and a little bit about it because I'm not for sure any really information on it. Yeah a super late model is a made for racing chassis. It's a, it's an all aluminum motor um, you know they we run big tires. Uh, here at the track they've got four different divisions and and they go from the lowest budget all the way to the highest budget, which is what the late model is. And, you know, it's unlimited money, unlimited everything. And that's kind of been our problem this year. We don't have a lot of money, but we've been fortunate enough to run good. So, Well, that's a good thing. How many years of experience do you have with racing? I've been racing since 2000. Okay, so quite a while here. Yeah. What's the best advice you could give to a young driver that's just starting out? Uh, you know, just get as many laps as you can. Um, don't get tied down to one track, you know, get experience the different shapes and sizes of all these different tracks across the country, you know, and, you know, that's what, when I first started, my dad, we traveled all over the place, you know, and just, just get your butt in the seat and really, you know, really get out there and get some practice in and don't worry about change, making the car fast, make yourself fast. That's, that's some good advice. And can you tell us your favorite track that you've ever raced at? Oh, it's definitely Brownstown Speedway. You know, it's we're close to home, and, and you know this is a big, wide track. It's fast at times, you know, and sometimes too fast. <laughs> you know, they, uh, I gripe about that a little bit, but uh, but no, it's it's a it's a perfect race track to, for one, to get learned on, and you can also, you know, you can race on this track. You know, we've been a few tracks across the country where they're just too tight and or one lane right around the bottom, and you know here you if you got a good enough car, you can get up and move around. Well, thank you so much for this interview, and good luck tonight, and I hope to see you out there. Thank you very much.